So my mom and I have come out here to Spectacle Island. No, what island are we on? I don't. George's Island. Island. We're out here on George's Island, and we have a spectacular view. It's a really great place to sit and reflect and think about things. So. Tomorrow's the big day. I'm gonna go and start exercising, and I'm a little nervous. This ought to be an interesting project for the next 10 weeks. So tonight to celebrate, I had a plate of nachos and wine <laughs> with the improv people that I played with just to, uh, I figured it was like my last supper. My name is Tanya Dollhouse. I'm five foot five. I weigh 190 pounds and I'm 36 years old. I would like to lose at least 20 pounds in the next two months. My overall goal is to lose 50 pounds. Today I'm going to meet with my nutrition coach and my physical trainer for the first time. Um, I'm feeling a little nervous about this whole thing and have a little bit of anxiety about looking all sweaty in front of the camera and having people actually know how much I'm gonna, how much I actually weigh. So, but I'm very excited. I think this is going to be a great thing. Hi, I'm Jonathan. Hi. Good, good to meet you. Nice you ready to meet for you as well. Nutrition? I am excited and ready. Great. We're going to cover uh, a little bit about what you're eating historically so I get a sense of the, the mistakes you're making and the good things you're doing, and then we can kind of correct for that. Let's just check your weight right now. Yeah. So, 190. So, it's about 195. Does that seem be much different from what you're used to? Um, it could be. My scale at home says 190. It's okay. one of those. And this is going to give us two readings. It's going to give us a body mass index on the top. We're interested in the reading below, which is your body fat percentage. 39.2. Daily calorie recommendation of 2,189. Okay, now most people think that that's a lot of that's calories. That's a lot of calories. Right. <laughs> that's a, that, that, those calories are designed to keep you metabolically healthy. I was surprised to find out that I haven't actually been eating enough calories. I've always eaten pretty healthily, um, but I don't eat enough or frequently enough. I've got to really change my lifestyle in terms of eating more and eating more throughout the day instead of missing meals for 10 hours at a time. And then what I want to do with you every week, every time we meet, to check in. I want to set a goal for the next week. Two to three. Okay. I'm comfortable with three probably for a little while, but there'll be a point at which I'll push back on you and I'll say, I think three is aggressive. You can shed weight very, very quickly. You can give up muscle and you can give up fluids. Right. Um, but getting up more than two pounds of fat can be challenging. And even if you're able to do that, sometimes you'll give up things you don't want to give up. So we'll, we want to be kind of slow and conservative so that you hit a weight that you can maintain. Right. I met with my physical trainer. We had a great workout session. She really worked my legs. So I go really quick from one thing to the next. <laughs> I like to do circuits. Working out today was pretty much what I expected. Um, we did some unique new exercises that I've never done before, so that was exciting because I always like to try some new things. So I'm excited to continue to keep working with her. I think we're going to be doing a lot more cardio than I'm used to. So for all of you out there that are going to be watching this, I would love to get your feedback and support, whether it's criticism or positive. Either way, I'm ready and open for it all. So, and eat lots of nachos for me. No, just kidding. Don't really. <laughs>